Good evening, Dean College. My name is Brett Shops. And I'm Ryan Bell. And this is Dean, Dean News Network. Network. Well, Ryan, this is your first ever time here on News and Sports. How you feeling? I'm feeling pretty good. Got bulletin in a couple weeks ago and then did student on the street with Ben, so I'm starting to settle in a little bit here on D News Network, and I'm excited to get this going. Yeah, you've had a few appearances on Student on the Street. You and Steve have really been the, the dynamic duo. That is true. From what I've heard, we had the most likes on the Instagram page yeah. in our debut episode, so that's pretty cool. Already doing successful things, and with that, let's kick off some events this week. Starting off a busy week with campus news, interested in studying away? Head over to Dean Hall, room 203 on Monday from 2 to 3.15 p.m. for study away program drop-in hours. The Dean Daily will be holding their weekly meeting from 3 to 4 p.m. on Monday in Student Center 201. From 4 to 5 p.m. on Monday, there are three events happening. Yoga class will be taking place in Thayer Barn, Jewish Community Club meets in the Advising Center Conference Room, and Monday Minds will meet inside of Chapman House. At 5 p.m., be sure to stop by Science Building 11 for DNN's weekly pre-production meeting. At 6.30 on Monday, Active Minds will also meet inside of Student Center 201. To round out a busy Monday, BSO will meet at 7.30 p.m. inside Student Center 205. On Tuesday, SGA will meet from 4 to 5 p.m. inside of the Golden Room. Also on Tuesday, the Dean Activities Board will meet inside of Student Center 201. Lastly, on Tuesday, Photography Club meets at 8.30 p.m. inside of Student Center 102. On Wednesday, stop by the Student Center Concourse for the Employer Showcase beginning at 11 a.m. Following that, at 6 p.m., True Colors will meet inside of the Campanella Room. At 7 p.m. Wednesday, Black Student Union will meet inside of the Library, Room 330. RSA also hosts their General Body Meeting Wednesday at 7 p.m. inside of the Golder Room. On Thursday, Study Away office hours will occur again at 1 p.m. inside of Dean Hall, Room 203. Dean News Network will also host their weekly production session beginning at 5 p.m. on Thursday. That's located inside the Digital Studios. AMGT also meets Thursday at 6 p.m. in Student Center 204. And to finish out the night, both eSports and Thursdays at Boomers kickoff at 7 p.m. and 7.30, respectively. Lastly, on Friday, Agape Christian Fellowship will meet from 5 to 6 p.m. inside of Student Center Room 101. And we have a busy week in sports ahead. Uh, Dean College will start off on Tuesday, March 14th, when baseball travels to Hartford, Connecticut to face Trinity College at 3.30 p.m. Then on Wednesday, women's lacrosse head to Chicopee, Massachusetts, where they play Elms College at 5 p.m. And then moving on to Saturday, we have a jam-packed day with eight games being played. Men's volleyball will host a tri-match inside of Pierre Gymnasium, facing North Park University at 11 a.m. and Fisher College at 3 p.m. After that, baseball travels to Fitchburg State for a doubleheader at 12 and 2.30. And softball also has two games at noon and 2 p.m. in Buzzard Bay versus Mass Maritime. Next up, men's lacrosse face off against St. Joseph's College of Maine on Grant Field at 1 p.m. And finally, women's lacrosse goes to North Nashua, New Hampshire, where they face Riviera University also at 1 p.m. Rounding out the week on Sunday, baseball welcomes Curry College to Longley Athletic Complex for a 1 p.m. game. That's all for this week's episode of News and Sports. For Ryan Bell, my name is Brett Shavs. Thanks for tuning in and have a great night.